Well, look at that. Are those new Enheria I see in your roster? Your quest to save the world must be going well, then. I have no patience for your nonsense. If you value your life, you would do well to relinquish the gift. You're still very much dancing to Odin's sorry tune, I see. I guess I have no choice but to... What are you doing, Hilde? Was I not clear you were to return immediately after retrieving the artifact? Please, forgive my insolence. It matters not. So we meet at last, little Valkyrie. Oh, how I have longed for this moment. Do put away those trinkets of yours. I have no intention of harming you, for you shall all soon be mine. Who are you? And what are you scheming? Scheming? Why? Nothing at all. I only came to see the face of the poor Valkyrie forced to slave away for the almighty Odin's all-consuming folly. The Allfather hopes to save the world. Any who hinder him shall meet a swift death. Oh, how loyal. Though, let me ask you this. Did you ever stop to consider how he intends to go about saving the world? What are you... You haven't, have you? Oh, you poor, wretched thing. You've yet to realize that you are merely a pawn in his machinations. But I shall say no more. Deal with those creatures as you wish. We shall cross paths again, my sweet, unwitting Valkyrie. Think carefully about her words. She is more honest than Odin will ever be. Wait! Snap out of it! We can worry about them later. We've got slightly more pressing problems right now. Be the first to strike. Egon, I require your face. something fast, or things are going to go from bad to worse. What now? Oh, Father. As you can see, with my power restored, I can now send an avatar to Midgard. Thank you, Allfather. Were you concerned for our safety? 
I cannot have you die on me at such a crucial time now, can I? Are you all unhurt? Yes, All Father. Thanks to your assistance, we are all unscathed. Then I am glad. Now, there is another matter I wish to discuss. Return to Asgard post haste. Yes, All Father. I dread to think what would have become of us had Odin not intervened. Indeed. Let us return to Asgard. Odin used what little power he still has just to save us. His mere servants. I will not let his faith in us go squandered. Looks like we've got some free time on our hands. You know, we've become quite the party now. What say we get to know each other a little better? A bit of bonding? Yes. I think that could do us good. We're all so different, after all. The era we lived in. Our homeland. Knowing how we all think will make us stronger as a unit. What about you, Taika? Is there anything you'd care to know about? Huh? Uh, <laughs> well, actually, if it wouldn't be too much trouble, I'd like to find out more about the Valkyrie. Wouldn't we all? Although, now that I think about it, I feel like she's changed recently. When I first met her, it was like she was a puppet or something. She had no emotion, just completely focused on the task at hand. I remember feeling that too. Yet, recently, she started to listen more to what we have to say. You're saying that she's becoming more human-like? Yes, you could say that. She's definitely not as distant as she used to be. She provided me a chance to be rid of my regrets before I died. She's my savior. I know that much. It's not just you. She saved us all. Yes, it'd be more accurate to say that she is still saving us. I never thought I would serve another. But perhaps this is fate. I would do anything to serve her now. She needs our help too, though. So it's our duty to be there when she calls on us. So you believe in the good that she can accomplish? Thank you. I feel better now that I've heard how you all feel. Simply put, we follow her commands and fight by her side. I feel honored to call you all my allies and to fight for the sake of the world and for Valkyrie. Returned from Midgard, All Father. Thank you again for intervening in our time of need. However, it is with deep regret that I return without the next gift. It was stolen before we could obtain it. I see. Perhaps 
This was inevitable, considering who is against us. I failed to warn you of her. Our adversary was once a second-class Aesir. She goes by the name Fenrir. Fenrir. As you know, we gods can be classified according to strength. As a second-class Aesir, Fenrir is very nearly as powerful as myself. However, she is utterly corrupt, and her brutality knows no bounds. She is the epitome of true evil. Her craving for destruction was insatiable. And in her lust for power, she tried to take the throne, starting a war on Asgard. So the chaos that has engulfed this world, your wounds, they are all Fenrir's doing? Yes. I managed to wound her severely, yet I failed to deliver a fatal blow. But heed my words, Valkyrie. Do not seek her out, for she is far too powerful. Concentrate on the salvation of the world. That is your task. I shall not fail you. As you do that, I will attempt to locate her whereabouts. She cannot.